Hey, everybody out there in Diablo 4 land. Boy, let me tell you something. It's been, it's been a ride. Sorry I have not made no videos in a while. Because I wanted to learn the game and, you know, learn the mechanics and learn things and all this and that. And I heard, some people have said at least, that the game's complicated. The game's not complicated, guys. It's a lot to learn is what it is. Complicated means that you get on one subject of the game and have a hell of a time with it. You know, one subject would have like tons and tons and tons of different stuff to it. it I'm just, I just want to say this real quick. The game's not complicated. It's just a lot to learn. Okay. So guys, I have came up with a build. Now, I have not studied anybody's guides. I have not looked at anything. I did this all on my own. 100% solo built. Everything. I'm only level 56. But I think it's time to make a video. Now I have made a high level source and stuff. This ain't like my only character, of course. you know. But this is the one I want to showcase. Okay. So, first things first. Let's go ahead and look at the uh, <clears throat> let's go ahead and look at the uh, skills. So, what I have done here is I have created a what a shadow, I guess, is the damage we're doing. But I say poison because that's what I'm used to saying. But we'll, we'll go with shadow, whatever. It's a shadow slash summer build is what it is. Okay, That puts out m masses amount of damage when needed. Okay, It ain't really set up to kill this little monster here and that little monster there. So, I got this just to move the tree. I don't even use this. I got that to move, you know, the skills across the tree. I maxed out Bone Spear because single target, when there's nothing else around for me to corpse explode, I have something to kill that one guy with, okay? And it works good. You'll see. It works really good. All right. We went ahead and maxed out, uh, you know, the damage targets and areas. Now, I'm not going to sit here and read everything, but you can, you, you can stop the video and read it. Okay, we maxed out Corpse Explosion. We got this instead of this. Okay, because, you know, you want uh, it to do that. Because I have an item that makes it have a little dude that runs and hits and explodes. And that that's why I picked this right here. You'll see when we're doing the build. Alright, I grabbed this right here because this gets the corpses going pretty fast. And the first thing I hit them with usually is this right here. Okay. And I went ahead and, you know, well, you're going to get the middle one no matter what. But I went ahead and went with this one. Because at the same time, you need to think about surviving, all right? Uh, whenever I use my bone spear, I run out of essence really fast. It's like three or four shots. So I got this right here. So when I'm picking up corpses or I'm corpse exploding, I'm getting back my essence really fast, okay? Uh, and plus, I'm building damage. So both of those go hand in hand. You get your essence back, and you're building damage, and then you launch your big attack, okay? Um, this right here is just, just extra survivability for them and you and all that. Okay. I max this out. I got my camera like right in front of my TV, so I gotta kind of pick things up to see them. Um, you'll be you'll be hitting you'll be you know corpse exploding. They're like I was saying, these things run, so they're a long ways away from you sometimes when they hit monsters. So this just works out great. So I maxed it out. This is just more survivability da, 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 for your summonings. Like I said, it's a, it's a it's a corpse explosion slash summoner build. We max this. Because, we, like I'm saying, man, your summonings have to survive and all this kind of stuff, you know. And I maxed out all three of these. Okay. You can read them if you want to. It goes in with the shadow build. That's what it's for. I did not max this one because I feel it's just not worth it. Three seconds of running fast. Now, if it was like 12 seconds of running faster, I could see it. But three seconds, forget it. Even 10 seconds, forget it. It's not worth it. I mean, you're going to waste two skills here, just to move a little quicker for a couple seconds. Nah. Okay. As of now, wait, let me see. As of now, I went with Army of the Dead because I'll show you, I'll show you when I show my gear why I done that. Okay, so Army of the Dead is, is uh, just right here, okay? 
and then get this. If you want to follow my build, go ahead and get this passive, all right? Okay, now, Paragon. Not really a lot to see here because I'm just getting it kind of started, but I shot up through here. Um, and like I said, in the tree, I'm sort of going for the survivability and damage of the minions because I'm doing a lot of damage. I want them to do a lot of damage too, so I'm using the tree to do that with. Okay, I shot up here. I went ahead and I'm, I'm starting to level this. Because I want both pieces, and you gotta you gotta level your gym to get both pieces. Okay, that's a whole nother video. I'm just showing you. Okay, as you notice, most of it is to the summonings, or well, it will be. I'm on my way to it. I went this way, and here it goes. It's gonna get this, 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 this. Oh, not that, not this, guys. This. Okay, and then I'm gonna shoot up this way, come over this way, grab this 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 you know what I'm saying <clears throat> come over here and get this I'm, I'm doing the tree for summonings all right so you, you get it you know you understand that okay items so far what I've come up with I'm not gonna read all of it you can stop the video and read it if you want to but as you can see it goes to survivability now this ain't hardcore but I still don't like dying okay so it goes to survivability and then to my corpse explosion, to my summonings. So survivability, corpse explosion, summonings, and the gear. That works out pretty good too. This is where the army of the dead comes in. Check that out. When active, minions gain 70 attack speed and take 90 reduced damage. So pretty much whenever you're in the army of the dead, you're not dying. Nothing's gonna die except for them. <laughs> All right, and this right here is going to click that key passive that I was showing you in the in, in the uh, tree. 50%. Guys, 10 times, it don't take long at all. So I'm basically going to do 50% more damage at all times. Okay? There might be maybe a second or two there where I'm not doing it, but I mean, you know. Okay, and this is just more attack speed. This, this favors the Army of the Dead things. You know, put them both together. And as you can see in the second writing, when you're looking across there, it also goes with fortification of the survivability and stuff. I tried to make sure that everything matched each other. You know what I mean? Slowed enemies. We're going to be slowing a lot of enemies and stuff like that. You know, the top piece there on that ring don't don't go with nothing. But you got your you know you got your darkness skills and shadow and you know a little bit of bone stuff going on there. And the bottom one. I don't. I haven't not implemented implemented Blood Wave. I don't know. I might try it to see how good it is. Um, this right here is where a lot of my damage is coming from. When he runs and he hits, that's what happens. He throws that poison, boom, blight down. I call it poison, or whatever. Shadow. All right. So that's pretty much the gear. Um. I don't really know what else I could show you. Let me see. I'll show you that. I'll show you the Paragon. Okay. So well, let's see it in action, guys. Let's do... Hmm. Where's a close TP? I don't want to be running all over the place trying to do something. I should have already had this set up knowing what I was going to do, but I didn't, guys. I'm sorry. I'm looking. Um, look, here we go. There's a bunch of them. Go we'll to a random spot, whatever. So I just want to showcase the build. I just want to show you how it works and what it does. Now, as far as it working in game, I have no idea. Okay. Uh, like I said, I'm only level 55 or 56 or something. So we're, we're going to see how this goes. I'm just showing you what I'm doing. I'm trying to create something completely authentic that no one else has that I know of. I mean, I'm sure that other people have come up with it too. But this is my version of it. All right, let's see it in action, guys. Yeah, I just slowly put it together, thinking about it. You know, when I'm going to sleep at night, I'm thinking about it. When I wake up, I'm thinking about it. And this is what I ended up coming up with. And I like it. It's fun. Here we go. Destroy the blood, the blood thingies. All right. Oh, you see 
this black. So the little dude that ran right there, and then when he hits, he pops up his pile of stuff. I don't even have to aim, I can just hold the button down and hurt the guys for one by that will have to lie. So if it's alive, it's gonna be a hit. That does a massive amount of damage. Very fun, very satisfying. I like it a lot. I'm not ready yet. get it though how it works you know but I want to really show you come on he's loading the screens man there was one there was a dungeon yeah the iron hole yeah, hopefully it's not nerfed too bad I hope they all ain't nerfed that bad I haven't played since it did the nerfs Yeah, I really hope they didn't nerf it too bad in here. Hopefully that guy does not join us. But I have been a 100% solo play through the whole game, man. How it looks now. like tons and tons of stuns all over the place. Oh, it's so annoying. I really hope that they back off some of that stuff. It's so unusual. Stun bar. Hell down on the ground. It's not what I consider the only game. Hopefully there's enough in here to you know enough stuff, items in there to count.
just wouldn't be. Where the hell is something? Dude, have they just, just totally destroyed this whole area? Here we go. Now. Now. There's a bunch of them. that right up to that. It's definitely a build set for high density. Works really good. Very satisfied with it. Don't know how it's going to perform in the super high level. I'm just going to pass this area here. items a little bit of everything and it works good a little bit of this a little bit of that all right we're going to set all right this is how it does wait am i going to a boss yet yeah here's how it does on the boss Oh, God. 
guys. I don't know how it's going to be in game. Like I said, but we'll see. All right, man. Odin God logging out. Definitely more videos to come. We'll catch you guys on the flip side. Keep a lookout. I'll be making more. Hasta.